Welcome back. Thanks for watching the video today, guys. I am here with another Forza Horizon 5 daily challenge, and this one is called In Reverse. I don't know why, but I don't know what that has to do with, like, I mean, maybe reverse entry. Like, that's pretty crazy to do, but complete a drift theme Horizon Arcade in any drift car. Now, I thought yesterday this was going to be hard to find a drift Horizon Arcade instance, but on the map, we are lucky, and we found one right here. So we will fast travel, Horizon Arcade will be and Good luck. I gotta switch something real quick. Hold on, bear with me. I gotta put this audio in my headphones. There we go. Okay, so now that I'm here, I need to switch to a drift car, and I don't have to exactly meet that when that countdown starts. I can start the Horizon Arcade event a little later, but I'm gonna go to my treasure trove of Formula drift cars. <sighs> What should we use today? My favorite is probably got to be this um, Chevy V8 LLS swapped BMW. I'm sure that's what's in there. I mean, it's what it sounds like. This was like the first one I got. Um, I really like this one as well. This one's great from Forza Horizon 3. Um, the Viper's not bad. Hmm. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pull an audible. I'm going to jump in the the Vaughn Gittin machine. That's what we're going to use. Now, for drifting, I recommend uh, using the manual gearbox. I don't see, unless you're going to clutch kick or something and you're just like a god, I don't see the point in running manual with clutch unless you really want to. Look at this guy. What's he doing? Oh, we got some people here. We got another Vaughn Gittner. We got that guy back there. Oh, this is gonna be this is gonna be pretty lit. I guess it's because it's the daily challenge and it's fairly early. This might have been the first one. But we're gonna downshift. Oh, we can't get neutral. That's why a clutch would be great. But it's fine. We're all pointing in this direction. I hope it's this way. Twenty seconds. Here comes somebody else. Is he going to join us? No, he's he's far away. Who's over here? Somebody's over there. They left. I just like drifting. So now we're in. Now we can do it. We should be able to get this very fast with as many people as we have. Sometimes the destination or the target will keep moving as more people will join or whatever it feels like. I'm just going to stay on this outside here and make sure I stay within. There we go, we're done. This is gonna be like a record. <laughs> oh wait, it's drift run. So I need to get these to bank. There we go. I just bank some. So basically for this one it's just going to tell you to drive somewhere and then you'll have to drive back to where you started while drifting. So I just added that big score so that helped us out a lot. If a lot of other guys, if they're still drifting, if they would just close out, if you get above 100,000 just let it count. Maybe even above 50. If you actually hold a drift the entire time, it'll never count. There we go. 
I think I think I set that one off because when I stopped it, it completed. So what are we doing here? We got a drift zone we gotta get to. So I'm gonna I'm in fourth, which is the highest gear I have. But I'm just gonna put it in fourth and kinda cruise over to there. I don't really want to drift if I can help it. Until I get to the drift zone. Because I can go faster if I'm just driving. There we go. That was nice. So on this drift uh, zone, you have to hit it. And... You can't let it fail. Because then it won't count. I'm just going to hold E brake for here. And now we're good. I'm not going to get out of third. Fourth would be like a super high speed drift. This is, this is tight enough I can stay in third. I wish I had a little bit more. As far as wheel speed went. But look, we're almost done. If I can get another one off, it'll be... That would be surprising. So I'm just going to rip through here and try to go as fast as I can so it counts. But I bet you it'll finish before I'm done. Because here comes, you know, how many guys. I'm telling you, third is where it's at, guys. Yep, completed. I didn't even get to finish, but I'm going to. There we go. So there's going to be another one, and that one's air. Let's do that one. Great job, team. What the shirt am I doing? I just said something I didn't want to say for what I don't know why, because I'm dumb. There we go. Okay, so we got this completed. We have one more. There goes our drift theme, Horizon Arcade, in a drift car. So tomorrow, the day before the big one, we have... Aged well, earned three stars in any speed trap in a classic racer. So, pretty easy. We'll see what we can do with that tomorrow, make something out of it. Um, air. I think air is the one with the bullseyes. So, I had an accolade that I needed to complete in online Horizon Arcade. Complete a drift run round in a Japanese car. What did I use? I used an American car. I'm an idiot. It's fine, though. It probably wouldn't even count because it was Formula D that I was looking at. So. So this one. I need. That's what I was doing. I was in the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento, but the rally-ish kind of version I have. So. Here it is, this little guy, and Horizon if, will begin soon. yeah, it's 10 minutes. Why not say hello to the other drivers whilst you wait? So here's what we're going to do to entertain ourselves, okay? I've been filming for 8 minutes here, okay? I'm going to try to get some skill points. That's what I'm going to try to get. Woo! Starting off with a big number. 175. Almost getting me back to 10 million. News. Horizon Tour. I don't know either. What? Um. Okay, so I can't start an event. I can't do anything really because I may lose this Horizon Arcade instance. So I'm going to stay around here. And I'm going to try and get as many... Uh, I need to switch back to automatic. I'm going to try to get as many skill points as I can. So the best way to do skill points... Um, this car has a bunch of... What you call it? Upgrades as far as like the skills or whatever. I'll show you here the car mastery skills so I have a lot of these that raise it you know 15% 15% 20% for combos it builds two times as fast 
twenty percent. These are all racing ones. That's convoy. I'm not in a convoy, and I'm not doing road races. I'm not event finishing, and I'm not doing triple pass. So I only give. I only did the ones I needed for this kind of thing. So already I'm above sixty. I'm trying to see here. Drift will save your life. If you need to, just tap that e-brake and hit sideways. Especially if you're in a high-powered vehicle like this, all-wheel drive. And wreckage is the other one. If you can get a fence, I just stay away from trees. Um, but there is like that wrecking ball, like those different ones that add like you know a thousand or two thousand side swipe. They're different ones when you combine skills. When you get like a wreckage and a drift, or an air and a wreckage, different things like that. They are important to getting these skill scores high. But I think this is a great way. Just don't run into anything. Now I do have like a angel thing, I don't know what it's called. Kind of like a guardian angel thing, but like the first time I hit something, it doesn't take it away. So what I suggest is that you if you have that on and you do hit something just stop and let those points count because if you hit something again in that same chain you will lose it all so if you're prone to hitting things like I sometimes am um, you're just gonna end up losing your streak but it'll be bigger when you do lose it so I'm just kinda playing around and seeing how far I can go with it 350,000 here and if you if you build like crazy so I have 70 75,000 okay don't hit that um, I have that times five if I can get lucky and get a skill song usually you can do this long enough to get a skill song I'm gonna try to get this board right here dang it um, there is if you want to do this for real there is like a house you can buy or something that your um, radio only plays skill songs. So that's where I should probably be if I want to do this. I'll have to move. This guy's following me around. So we're at 500,000 right now. We have not hit anything. We haven't even used our um, saving grace or whatever that thing is. Remember, if you hit trees, if you hit anything immovable, if you hit a car, now not another player, you'll ghost, you'll ghost through those. But if you hit that stuff, you will lose your points, or at least lose your guardian angel type thing. Why is that guy following me so much? I'm going to try to get this build with there we go. That gives you more, doesn't it? Side sweet. Sometimes, you, if you're doing so much like I am right now, it'll lag. And you won't get your... There we go. That's how long it took to get that skill board. At least, like, five seconds. So we're up over 125,000. What is that? 130. That's 650. Right? If my math is correct. Now, there are challenges or accolades. I call them challenges for lack of a better term that I'm used to, but I guess I could train myself to say accolades, but there are some things in there that you need to do, um, I believe it's like a million or 600,000, there's even one where you have to get a super high score and then hit something and lose it, so check those out, and uh, you, this is a great way to complete them, but there are some cars, in Forza Horizon 4 there was a BMW that had tons of skill points and boosts. This is kind of the car I've found that has them in this game. This is the uh, 2011 Lamborghini Sesto Elemento Forza Edition. Okay, and I have upgraded to X999 and rally suspension, rally tires, and all wheel drive. And this thing is just a hoon machine. Speaking of Hoon Machine, have you guys seen the new Ken Block crazy classic Porsche? I think he's calling it the Hoonapig, Hoonapigasus, 
The name isn't the greatest thing, but I can't wait to see that car. I think it's a Pikes Peak car. He's going to go up Pikes Peak with it. But it looks sick. I love the livery. They wrote Hoonigan in like this real drippy, like um, almost like a paint or a marker style. So if you've been watching this video this long, you have seen me take this uh, skill chain for about seven minutes now. And we're almost to uh, a million. I really would like to see a skill song come on. I'm going to try and change the radio while I'm drifting around and see if a skill song does come on. Yeah, I think you would benefit from having that um, house where you get that only skill songs you play type thing. There we go. There's a million for you guys. Ultimate skill chain. I mean, that's just... It's nuts. I think you have to get like a 2 million one. I'm not sure. Let's go look. Uh, what would that be under skills? Let's see here. Skill chain. There's a million. There's 1.5. There's 2. There's 2.5. I guess that's the final one. You have to bank it. Now let's let's look at the one where it says lose. I wonder where the lose would be. Is it this one? No. Hmm. Then you have to do it in certain cars. You have to get at least a seven multiplier. Is this it? Yeah, lose a skill chain that would have been worth at least a million. But as you can see, I have all those. So also, I'm trying to get another accolade. That's why I'm here with this Lambo. I need to complete a bullseye thing in this. In the Lambo. 19 seconds. Alright, we're gonna pause. We're gonna see what direction I need to go. Man, it is hot in here. Woo! This computer heating things up. Here we go. Where is it? So we are heading over there. Any car that's built like this that has high horsepower, all wheel drive, and off road capabilities. Um, I just drive in straight on. Look how fast I'm going. I'm going 200. Jumping mountains. Like, it's ridiculous. But it's fun. So I'm here. And I have to get air skills. I think I'm the only one playing. But as you can see, there's these little rock piles. Anytime you catch any air. A little bump, a huge jump, whatever. That's an air skill. I wish you got more credit, like you got multiple credits for bigger ones, like say an awesome air, an ultimate air. You just got one for like an air. That would really help out. Also, there's levels to this. You can come off the bridge. You can hit this one. Looks like we need 10. This should be the last one. Alright, we're on to this, this direction. Oh, so here's what we need for the accolade. We need to complete this bullseye challenge in a Lamborghini. Sometimes we get turned sideways a little bit. Alright, so where is it? We're over here. This one's weird because there's a big circle, but you'll have jumps. So I need to hit that jump this direction. And depending on your power level, like this one, I do not want to go too fast. You want to get the bullseyes. 
did not get it. So you just keep going. The more points you get, that's when you'll finish. It's really hard to judge the distance. But I'm trying. Yeah, that is bothering me. Alright, watch this one. Now look, you'd think that'd be easy, right? It didn't give it to me. It didn't give me a bullseye. So it is hard. That was 500. I have gotten bullseyes. I promise you. I can do it. Where are we going? Where's the jump for this one? I just gotta use the land? What the? Did that one not load yet? I gotta hit this one? Alright, I'm gonna go as fast as I can. Barely got it. Where is this next one? There we go. I think it... I don't know if I got it, because I think you have to get a bullseye, I'm not sure. That would be unfortunate. But anyway, here we go. We're trying to finish up this solo run at this Horizon Arcade instance. Uh, with the air skills. So this is a danger sign. I gotta make my way to. I love how it says group progress. If you're the only one here, it just should just say your progress. Then at least you'd know there was somebody else. I don't want to be alone. Okay, here we go. Where is it? I really hate this danger zone. This one is not fun. I can't believe it didn't fail me. So just one more time and we'll be good. Actually, if I jump it backwards, it counts. Did that complete it? Yes! Oh! <laughs> what? Horse. Okay. Alright, here we go. Watch this. You ready? Tiniest jump ever. Congratulations! You have Forza points. Forza Thon points. Great, I didn't win anything. Where's the accolade? I'm really gonna lose it. I had to get a bullseye, didn't I? Okay, I got it. I got it. I didn't have to get a bullseye, it said bullseye, but. Like I said, the, the notifications lag a little bit. Maybe I got it during the during the event. Who knows? All right, that's gonna do it for today, guys. You got to see me complete two Horizon Arcade events, one of which was the Daily Challenge, and it was the Drift Variety in Reverse Complete a Drift Theme Horizon Arcade in any drift car. Drift car. You know what? I have a question about that real quick. What makes it a drift car? Does it have to be like formula drift? Are there is there a I didn't think there was a drift car thing. Oh no there is. Huh, okay. So make sure it's one of these. Make sure it has that tag at the end of it. So you have some in Hoonigan. You'll have some in Formula Drift. Of course, you'll have the Ford. And there are some DeBerti ones. But I don't know if there are any more. This is just what I have. But hopefully that helped you guys out. If you liked the video, please let me know by leaving a like down below. I appreciate every single one. I check them all the time. That's how I know that I'm putting out stuff that you guys actually like and want to see. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, I'm here every day playing Forza Horizon 5 mostly with the daily challenges 
but on Thursdays we're doing the big festival playlist. That's where that's the first day it starts and I try to do it all. Okay. So coming up on this Thursday, we have the spring hot season. There's our cars we're looking at. We have I guess the Myers Manx Dune Buggy for the weekly challenge. It's also in the Forza Thon shop, looks like. We have some daily challenges. The trial looks to be ridiculous because it's that old school Bentley. We'll see what we have to do there. That's what we're going to win, but we'll see. Maybe it's just like a classic type thing. Um, we got some Event Lab. Playground games are back. We have one PR, two PR stunts, three seasonal championships, a photo challenge. Horizon Open and Eliminator. So I look forward to seeing you guys on Thursday for that. Tomorrow we will be completing um, this challenge here. The three stars speed trap and any classic racer. In a classic racer. So I'll see you guys then for that. In the next one. You guys have a good day. Take it easy. Stay cool. I'll see you later.